Welcome back to JH Diesel. We're out here at Redneck Mud Park for the Fall Classic. We're gonna be running the X3 today. We got side-by-side -side races going, head-to-head side-by-side -to -side racing on the mud racing track. We all know Burgundy's down right now with the engine problems, so we're gonna, let's bring the X3 out, see if we can get some racing done. So, so they're saying turbo class, big purse today. I'm ready to freaking rip, dude. So this thing's running good. We got back from Glamis the other week. I think we got a good chance. Usually some really fast ones, but I think we got it. I think we'll be good. They're just kind of pacing the field right now. But I figured I'd show you what the track is. These are the non-turbo side-by-sides. So it's a rolling start this time, which I don't think I ever remember a race that was a rolling start. So they're doing a rolling start. So they're gonna go up the middle. And we'll see if they're gonna go, it looks like they're gonna go to their left. They're gonna come back down this left side over that jump, obviously. That defender he always does really good in these races he does not care at all down right there it is on its roof tires in the air like a turtle brief intermission while they get that thing flipped back over and we'll go back to racing that's the end of it so that's your first place and i believe the defender is going to be second so they're coming around i think they're getting ready to go it's turbo clash justin drayson he's right there on the inside here they go as long as he doesn't overdrive, I think he'll be in the money. Yes, sir. Good to see he didn't let up on that. Oh, yeah. Quick, quick, 
it up before the jump. Looks good. Thing is running. It's got a brand new belt in it. We fixed the launch control button yesterday. They usually start from a dead start here. But this is a rolling start, so that didn't help me too much on this race. I had said that it looked like it was kind of nosing down, but you said there was a pretty hard kicker on that jump. Really bad there, kicker yeah. on that jump. Like you had to really hit that thing just right. And like this jump, you could literally just never lift and sky it. But the other ones, yeah, I came down hard on the right one time and I was like, God, it sounded like something literally like broke. We can't break nothing else, man. <laughs> Don't even say that. We too much broken stuff. We cannot <laughs> Don't you say that. Something. No, all in all, it's pretty good race. How it looked from the outside. It looked good. I mean, yeah, it you, was all like, you, you were laughing. <laughs> Well, I mean, if, I was like, this would be a good time to have a radio where I could tell me hey, you could just slow down a little bit. Well, I knew when I was coming up on the cow, I was like, man, I would, dude, I think it's just, I was sanding it through the corners. Like, I could hug the tires, like, right there. I was like, all right, we got a line. I got kind of got a line going. I could literally, on the back, I would just mat it and drift all the way around that back corner. And then this one, if I could hug that tire and just, my tire was like, felt like it was this far away from yeah. like a foot. So, it was fun. It was cool. So, we took home W. 700 bucks paid for the weekend that's what we so, came for honestly i had tried to invite side by side blog out to these and i told them we're gonna have side by side races and stuff they all got scared they said so, something about well, they couldn't make leo the was scared leo's like i got a pro r it's just not that fast and stuff so he's like i don't want to go doug would have raced you know uh you know the other guys would race matt mike justin but leo just didn't want it to happen he didn't want to see his pro r get beat so Old X3 wins again. No lights, no front thing. She's ready to go, dude. She's a stripped down race model. I mean, we had to pull weight off it. She's a race machine. Got our boy Alan here. Slow motion.
So we got this guy hooked to this guy. Some big trucks here that are pretty buried. Dude, what happened? Guys, this truck's for sale, by the way. Never bogged, never abused. Never bogged. Damn it, man. You'll have that. It is only Friday, though. Those two trucks are hung up. They're high centered. stuck too bad he looks stuck but he's just high centered so hopefully they can just pop him up out of there there he goes there you go perfect what do you think pretty good there it is wasn't sure how that was going to go out but 